Morning, Peace Up. I'm Abby. And I'm Andrew. And we're here with your morning announcements. Peace Up bands are hosting a variety talent show. Auditions are open and will close on January 15th. Look for the post with the QR code or stop by the band rooms at Plymouth to sign up. SAD will be meeting on Tuesday, January 16th at 7 a.m. Hope to see members there. Attention all Peace Up freshmen. Finals are around the corner and Linker will be hosting Coco and Cram after school on January 22nd from 2.30 to 4 in the Salem cafeteria. Bring your study materials and cocoa, and snacks will be provided. Flyers are posted around the school with QR codes to sign up. You do not need to sign up to attend, but those who have will be automatically entered in a raffle. Follow at Peace Up Link Crew on Instagram for more information. You can join the staff of 88 One The Park, one of the top high school radio stations in the country. Maybe you want to do sports play-by-play -play or work behind the microphone as a DJ. There are also opportunities for students to work behind the scenes on the station's promotion staff, and you can learn about news reporting and writing. An online audition application is available at 881thepark.com. All applications are due by Friday, February 2nd. An introductory Zoom meeting for students and parents is Wednesday, January 17th at 7 p.m. The Credit Union will be on campus this month. You can come to Plymouth this Friday, the 12th, or Salem on Friday the 19th. Be sure to check in on your balance for the new year. Attention all PHS sophomores. The class of 2026 will be meeting at 2.30 p.m. in PHS room 220C on January 11th. All PHS sophomores are welcome to attend. Attention all PHS freshmen. The class 2027 will be meeting at 2.30 p.m. in PHS from 220C on Friday, January 12th. All PHS freshmen are welcome to join us. If you are interested in physics, engineering, or computer science, consider joining the AstroGen Innovation Competition, an international high school competition where the task is to improve an existing piece of technology where you can win over $500 worth of prizes. For more details on how to participate, check out at the AstroGen on Instagram. Key Club is going to be making dog toys for the animal shelter at our next meeting, Thursday, 18th. The dog toys will be made from old t-shirts. If you have any old t-shirts you'd be willing to donate, please bring them on Wednesday, the 17th. Here are the drop-off locations. Canton, room 127, Career Center. Salem, room 2231, Styes, And Plymouth, main office, Dropbox. Attention juniors and seniors. The Career Center is your place to get information on colleges, military, and professional trades. To find more details and to register, juniors and seniors should go to the Career Center webpage and click on the upcoming college visit schedule. You can also keep an eye out for posts on our Instagram at PSEP Career Center. Are you looking for a job? Check out the virtual job board on the Career Center webpage. The job board is updated regularly. That's all for your announcements, PSEP. Hello, PSEP. I'm James here with your news bit. With legalization of marijuana in Michigan, teen use has increased. Unfortunately, many teens do not realize how dangerous marijuana is to the teen brain. Much of the marijuana available for sale has a THC potency of 20% or more. Concentrated cannabis products, including wax, bubber, and shatter, can have a THC potency as high as 95%. The high percentages of THC increase the negative effects on the brain and increase the likelihood of developing a marijuana use disorder. Studies in animals have found that exposure to THC in adolescents can reduce CB1 receptors in the brain and lead to long-lasting problems with memory and learning. Beginning cannabis use as a teen is more likely to lead to dependence. Compared with young adults, adolescents are more subjective or septile to dependence within a year up to taking marijuana. 11% of those ages 12 to 17 progressed to cannabis use disorder by 12 months. Even adolescent ages 12 to 17 whose cannabis use did not meet the threshold for substance use disorder were about twice as likely to develop depression or have suicidal ideation. THC changes teens' brains. Research, researchers analyzed close to 1,600 magnetic resonance images of brains of nearly 800 adolescents taken at 14 and 19 years of age on average. 
there was an association between cannabis use over the five years and an accelerated thinning of the prefrontal cortex. Every study shows that cannabis use negatively impacts the teen brain. Make decisions that give you the opportunity to have a successful future. That's all for your news bit. Good morning, PSEP. I'm Johnny here with your sports. Yesterday, Plymouth boys swim and dive beat Stevenson. Plymouth girls basketball lost to Howell. And on Tuesday, Salem boys varsity basketball lost to Heartland. This Sunday, the Detroit Lions face the Los Angeles Rams at 8 o'clock p.m. On Monday, the University of Michigan beat the University of Washington by a score of 34-13 to to become the 2023 national champions. Also, in college football, legendary coach Nick Saban announced his retirement yesterday. During his storied career, which included seven national championships, Saban coached at many schools including Michigan State, LSU, and he retired after 17 seasons at Alabama. That's all for your sports piece up. Good morning, PSEP. I'm Ellie Roper here with your weather. Today there's a high of 36 and a low of 30. Snow is expected to stop this afternoon. My name is Jamie North and I play the saxophone. Hello, my name is Melinda Carlisle and I'm one of the color guard section leaders. I'm Madison Mizell and I play the French horn. Anybody who goes to PSAP, no matter what grade, can join, including groups. We take pretty much anything from magic to uh, musicians. We love comedy, so any talent you have is perfect. It's been going on for 59 years. This is the 59th anniversary, and it's been going on since 1965. The variety is, is February 2nd at 7 p.m. We expect the program to last for approximately two hours. Auditions are virtual. You can scan any of the QR codes on the posters around the school. They are due January 15th, which is next Monday. Ten. Ten grains of fentanyl the size of salt is all it takes to kill. Visit DEA.gov to learn more. I think we should go to Taco Bell. I want Arby's though. Arby's? We went there last week. Two more grandma eats Arby's. I want pizza. Yeah. Pizza! 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 I'm so sick of pizza. pizza! Hey, you need to drive wise. You can't drive wise all this distraction. Wise drivers watch the road at all times. Identify problems that could arise, like traffic backups or wet, slippery roads. Leave space between yourselves and the car in front of you and evaluate what you need to do. All this noise is too much. Everybody out.